Real Madrid are held at home by Girona 1-1, but Jules, our boy Carletto, isn't happy with a penalty equalizer. Oh, and Tony Kroos gets his first <laughs> red of his career after 740 games. Yeah, that's true. First first red card in two yellows, by the way, so it doesn't really count as, yeah. as much as a straight red, but still, first time ever for him. Um, they look tired, Real Madrid, and Carletto said it at the end. He said, we played too many games. No Benzema, of course, who uh, still not fully fit, not completely confident in playing. The penalty is, is just a, an invention, like, like Ancelotti said after the game. You, do, you don't think the ball comes off Asensio's chest and onto his arm? Definitely. I don't think he touches his arm, the arm. And clearly they've seen that he touched the arm, but I even didn't think after touching his chest that he, would have, he should have been given had he touched I, the arm anyway. But for me, he doesn't touch the arm at any point. It's weird. You really can't definitively say, no. I thought, from the pictures. So then... So why you give can't the give it, but there's even the Rodrigo goal that was disallowed. I mean, there's, there's there oh, was I don't a have a problem thing. with that. The no, 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 hand, but the keeper's hand is on the ball, right? Yeah, yeah, I no, mean, no, I get that. But still, I but think I think for a game that they could have won, uh, maybe should have won, but they were not playing well, and no. I think the fitness is maybe a bit of a concern. And I think Ancelotti, I like to give him credit, and you know, I love yeah, to give of him course. credit. Is he said, look, it shouldn't have been a penalty. We should have won the game, but we played badly. Yeah, we That's played true. badly. Exactly. You know, simple as. Yeah. Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.